y'all. So this is going to be a me video, like, by myself. <laughs> no. <coughs> Ooh. I watched a video this morning, and it kind of, it, it kind of got my creative juices flowing and things going on, you know, in my mind about my channel. So, this, um, I just want to, uh, like reintroduce, uh, my family, uh, in this channel. Um, it's a family channel. It, it always has been. Um, anything I talk about, it will be family related as far as my children, myself, my, my husband, although he doesn't want to be seen in the videos, uh, whatever video we do, he just don't want to be a part of it now. Uh, he might stick his head in every now and then just to, you know, make me happy, but he doesn't, um, want to be involved really. And he likes his privacy, but being married to me, I don't know about privacy. So I, um, I want to say this, uh, lately I've been trying to get my, uh, channel going in the direction that I wanted to. And I couldn't figure out anything. So thanks to the Bells Plus One. Because Marcella, she is a saint. Um, she hit on some things that I'm I'm sure other YouTubers have. But coming from her, it's more of, you know, it's not a dictation. It's just her, you know, giving you some advice uh, on what you need to do you know what you could do to help your channel so thanks um marcia and uh i love your channel my daughter is crazy about you and mimi she loves you guys so now um about us um we're 30 something um we we both got married late um i'll say late because 30s well, it's not late because if you really think about it, it you know, it, it's it's like people should get married around thirty, you know, in their thirties because they'll they'll have experienced their twenties and things that you know twenty year olds do. Um, well, some twenty year olds. I'm not gonna say all twenty year olds, but you get the point. So anyway, we're a thirty something year old couple. We have, between us, three kids. I have two. He has one. Um, we became a solidified, so, solidified, y'all slap me, solidified. <laughs> and I said that like I knew that was the word. Solidified. We became a solidified union May 20th of this year, which is my birthday. Um... My husband, he's a, a workaholic to me. He works and he'll go to work. He'll go to work if it's an off day and they call and say, we need you. He'll go to work. He he loves to work. Um, and that's fine with me. I'm unemployed. I have been for the past maybe five years. Yeah, five years. Um, Julian is my son, the oldest. He's uh, diagnosed with... <sighs> He's diagnosed with ADHD, ODD, anxiety, and depression disorders. And when they're in school, that kind kind of like... Oh, my God. <sighs> I don't even know. I can't explain it. Um, I got a video about it that's up. Um, I think it's called Problem Child. Yeah, not necessarily calling him a problem child, but there's a problem child. <laughs> Your child has problems, you know, get that taken care of early. You know, if people or teachers, family members or anything are seeing things that you are not seeing, just take heed to it and, and get them evaluated so you will know early. I waited a little late, so that's why I'm, I'm in this situation right now. 
because going to work, um, it was it was hard trying to work and you have a child and you have to leave work to go to the school for your child. Now, that's that. Um, that's why I've been without work. I'm looking currently and I'm also looking for at home jobs because I don't want to go he's he's not all good right now he's a little better but I don't want to have those problems where I have to like just leave work you know so yeah anybody know any work at home jobs let me know down in the comments please okay we have also my stepson i will not name him right now because he's not in any of our videos right now but he is a sweetheart he he took to me when he first met me um just as his dad did <laughs> uh so you know just um i love my stepson uh, having my daughter she's a firecracker anything I ever wanted to do in my life I want, and she wants to do it I want her to do it because she's so energetic she loves doing gymnastics she loves to model she loves planning makeup she loves planning her damn hair um, she as far as school goes, right now I'm homeschooling her through Connections Academy and she doesn't like it. I like it for her, but I want her, by her not liking it, she don't give a damn like about her work. So she may not do her work as productive as she should um, now. I um I've talked to her about it to at least try and get her you know more focused on it. Excuse me y'all. Um excuse me, just excuse me. Anyway, so that's that. Um I'd like to also meet other uh, vlogging families and other families. I'm we're we're in Houston. I'm not gonna say what side of town, but we're in Houston, and we're just um just a family trying to get our feet wet with the whole idea of being um part of the YouTube family and. We started this channel, actually, I've been having a YouTube, I believe, since 2008, but I didn't turn it into a channel until maybe about 2014, maybe, 13 or 14. I think I made my first video in the end of December 13, I think December 2013. Um, The kids and I, we was just, you know, I watch YouTube a lot. They watch YouTube a lot. We watch YouTube more than we watch television, to be honest. Because I can't stand television unless it's something on cable. And I don't know. It's, it's just I don't like to watch the news. Even though I get the news every day, I do, you know, know what's going on in the world. I don't like to watch the news because in your hometown, I'm pretty sure some of you all can relate that in your hometown, news always seem much worse than everywhere else i mean it, it's just like that for me um i like to well myself i i do hair not often anymore because i got tired of doing hair i'm not licensed i did go to school but i'm not licensed i quit before i got my license um personal reasons again so i do hair but i'm not often and um youtube helps me stay fresh on my techniques and everything learning new things and stuff because i am in my 30s 
And should I decide to go back to school, I won't be behind on anything because you guys keep keep me informed and keep me taught. Keep you know. So uh nails, I love doing nails. Um my own in heavens. I do other people's when I have everything I need, but if I have just my my personal utensils and stuff, I won't do any nails. Um, um what else? I like to give advice. Um out in the real world, I'm gonna say yeah, in the real world, I'm gonna use that term. Out in the real world I do like to give advice and a lot of people actually do talk to me for my point of view on things um so yeah makeup i do wear makeup i love it but i'm not a guru although people love the way i you know the way it looks um i don't know if i can actually sit down and just make a video about it like putting on makeup and everything like that uh so that i love reading so i'm 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 just uh all of this i have written down in a tablet somewhere hmm. but anyway uh i love reading i had a book club on facebook at one point but i let it go because it will it was out of maybe 10 people that was a part of the group it was only about i'll say three to four that were active and then one fell off so it was down to like two or three something like that so let's see writing i'm currently writing little bits and pieces every day just to get my myself back motivated to doing a lot of things i have um papers put up that i wrote um that i never did anything with and they're just you know they're just put up i have people that tell me i have a, a brilliant mind and i should you know do things i have a story to tell and i do have a story to tell of my life and when i am ready i would do a quick video about it and um but i also want to write i do want to write a book about my life uh it is very unique <laughs> so uh i think that's about it um for me and the kids and i and my husband who will be a silent participant i'll say um will will uh we'll get this channel together with you guys help and you know with a lot of researching that i am now doing um yeah i'm gonna uh we're gonna do it so thank you guys for looking at this watching me up here talking i'm actually cooking right now so i had to sit down and make this video right quick because my husband he'll be home in a little while looking for something to eat so you guys I'm gonna, I think I actually, I will have like three videos today and I, I think that's a good thing for me. Um, yeah, I think it'll be three videos coming in with this one. One of me cooking and having an idea the Whisper Challenge again and I'm not, I'm gonna upload it as is. I'm not gonna not upload it because I'm sick of holding on to it. Somebody actually inboxed us and said, hey, where's the whisper challenge? <laughs> so I'm going to do the whisper challenge. And, and my niece, she actually wants to see the whisper challenge um, because that's the only way she can see us sometimes. So I'm going to go ahead and upload that. So that's three videos in one day. I'm proud of us. Heaven as well. Um, and you know what I think I may do though, um, do to get us into really vlogging. I think that, um, me vlogging our weekends will be 
a way to get us involved because daily vlogging i can't do that only because most of the time when heaven goes back to regular school because i do intend to transition her back into regular school um i'll be the only one at home and i'll just be vlogging myself doing house chores and what nothing so no i don't think that i think yeah i think weekend vlogging would probably be good and just during the week just do some you know regular videos all right y'all i'm through rambling and running my mouth and i'll see you guys later bye